Hello, welcome back to my channel Cine's Primary Math. In this video, we are going to learn about visualizing solid shapes. Those who are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to get my new videos. Here are some cubes and arranged them in different shapes as shown. Guess how many cubes are there when observed from the U shown by the arrow mark. Try to guess the number of cubes in the following arrangements. Visualizing solid shapes is a useful skill. Sometimes when you look at combined shapes, some of them may be hidden from your view. You should be able to see hidden parts of the solid shape. Viewing different sections of a solid. 3D objects can be viewed in different ways. One way to view an object is by cutting or slicing. Look at this loaf of bread. It is like a cuboid with a square face. Now slice it with a knife. When you give a vertical cut, you get several slices as shown. This is a cross section of the whole bread. In this case, the cross section is nearly a square. If your cut is not vertical, you may get a different cross section. Look at the cross sections of some vegetables. View of 3D shapes. We can look at the 3D shapes from different angles. The front view, the side view and the top view. It can provide a lot of information about the shape observed. Any three dimensional shape has a top view, side view and front view. Top view. Shape of the object. When you see the object from the top, or from directly above called as top view of an object. Side view. Shape of the object when you see the object from one side. Friend view. Shape of the object when you see the object from the front direction. Now look at the cube. We shall look at the top view, side view and front view. All we see a front face which is a square. A top view is also a square. This is the side view left and right of the cube which also a square. A cube will always look like a square whether it's front view, side view or top view. Cylinder A cylinder is a three dimensional solid that contains two parallel bases connected by a curved surface. The bases are circular in shape. Top view When we see the cylinder from the top then it looks like a circle. Friend view. When we see the cylinder from the front view, then it looks like a rectangle. Side view. When we see the cylinder from the side view, then it looks like a rectangle. Pyramid. A pyramid is a three-dimensional shape formed by connecting all the corners of a polygon to a central apex. There are many types of pyramids. Most often they are named after the type of base they have. This is a square pyramid because of its base as a square. Side view of this pyramid looks like a triangular shape for left and right side. Bottom of the pyramid has square shape. From the top, 
it will look like a square. Cone. Side view for cone, it will look like a triangle. From the top, it will look like a circle. Plan and elevation drawing of 3D shapes. When an architect designs a building, they will draw the plans and elevation of a building. A plan is a scale drawing showing a 3D shape when it is looked at from top. The plan is what you would see if you were looking directly down. An elevation is the view of a 3D shape when it is looked at from the side or from the front. Look at the cube arrangements shown. 2D views of 3D shapes. The layout of the plan and elevation drawings of 3D shapes align with each other. The height of the front align with the height of the side. The width of the plan should align to that of the front. Hope you got a clear understanding of the basic concepts in visualizing solid shapes. I know you are interested to learn more about geometry to make your concepts clear. Sure, I will be back with an interesting video titled 2D Views of 3D Shapes. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and share this video. See you in the next time. Till then, bye.